Good morning, East Baton Rouge Parish. This is your Mayor President, Sharon Weston Broom. And it is a good morning because we were spared in East Baton Rouge Parish um, from a horrific impact of Hurricane Ida. And so we are very grateful and thankful. Uh, what we experienced was a serious wind event overnight. And there, of course, are a lot of downed trees and power lines in our roadways and neighborhoods. This morning, the parish-wide curfew has expired. However, I need you to still stay at home and stay off the roads uh, because conditions are really not safe right now. Uh, I need everyone to stay off the roads because we have power lines down. And you can't tell if these power lines are live or not. Much of East Baton Rouge Parish is without power this morning. Entergy is reporting 137,051 um, customers without service. Demco, 30,190 customers. That's a lot. So many of you may be using generators. What I need you to do is to practice generator safety. Make sure the generator is not in your home and make sure that it is away from your home outside. Don't have it right near the window or close to your home. Have it away from your home. Now, overnight, first responders helped 10 people after trees fell on their homes. We're still responding to calls for help and we will be here to help you work through this. Some of our search and rescue teams have also deployed to surrounding communities, and that's what I wanted to say. We certainly were spared, but there were many communities around us that received significant impact. And so we want to help those communities. What we've done, we've sent our search and rescue teams and many of our other uh, essential workers, um, folks who work in the city parish government out to help those communities, out to help our neighbors. And so we will tell you how they are doing, but please uh, keep them in your prayers as well. Uh, Baton Rouge was certainly affected, as I said. Um, this is one of the things that we've done. We've already activated debris removal efforts. 40 crews are being deployed with trucks and chainsaws to clear roadways. They are out there to clear roadways. We'll be clearing the roads for at least the next 70 hours. Now that tells you how much work we have to do. We'll be cl clearing roads for the next 70 hours. For right now though, I have to reiterate this, the safest thing for you to do is to stay at home and off the roads. You might run into a tree. Uh, there may be a live wire on the road and you don't know it. So I want you to be safe. We've made it so far uh, through this major weather event and I want us to continue to be safe and I want your families to be safe as well. We're going to continue to keep the lines of communication open with you about our efforts in this recovery process. We're out this morning assessing uh, the damages uh, here in our city and in our parish, and uh, we will act accordingly with a strategic plan of recovery. But continue to stay calm, stay strong. If you need assistance, once again, Call 211 for resources and information. God bless, and God bless Baton Rouge and East Baton Rouge Parish.